times hallelujah. Good morning. Welcome to 21 Days with Jesus. Sometimes praise the Lord. Been out hiking this morning, worshiping the Lord. Sometimes Thinking of John chapter 15. Jesus said, I am the vine. In the Sacramento Valley, there's a humongous industry of vineyards. This is a vineyard right here. Came across it this morning. There are over 500,000 acres in California. Vineyards just like this. It's hard to believe. It's a $50 billion industry. Half a million people working. Vineyards just like this. Jesus said, I am the vine. Speaks about abiding in Christ. In the Gospel of John, chapter 15, the Bible says, I am the true grapevine, and my Father is the gardener. He cuts off every branch of mine that does not bear fruit, and he prunes the branches that do bear fruit, so they will produce more fruit. You have already been pruned and purified by the message I have given to you. Abide in me, Jesus said. I love this passage in scripture. Jesus said, abide in me. You'll find it in John chapter 15, verse number four. It's King James Version language. More modern translations use the word remain. I like the word abide, abiding in Christ. He is the vine and we are the branches. Abide in Christ, Jesus said, and I will abide in you. A branch, and that speaks of you and I, cannot produce fruit if it is severed from the vine. That's so powerful. If we become disconnected, if we become severed from the branch, we cannot produce fruit. You cannot be fruitful unless you abide in Christ. Abiding in Christ, what a significant biblical truth. You and I just like this vineyard. He's the gardener. That's what the Bible says. God the Father is the gardener. And Jesus says he is the vine, just like these vines. And that you and I are to be fruitful, but that can only happen in our lives if we are connected to him. To be abiding in Christ. John chapter 15, verse number five. Yes, I am the vine and you are the branches. Those who remain or abide in me, I will abide in them and they will produce much fruit. Apart from me, Jesus said, you can do nothing. So many people quote Philippians, I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. That can only happen if we abide in him. Abiding in Christ is spoken about in 1 John chapter 2. Whoever says he abides in Christ ought to walk in the same way Christ walked. Whatever you do today, no matter how difficult, no matter what struggles you face, if you are abiding in Christ in the good times and the bad times, you will be walking with Jesus in everything you do. It's found in 1 John chapter 2, verse 6. And you remember Philippians chapter 1. May you always be filled with the fruit of your salvation and the righteous character produced in your life by Christ Jesus. Philippians.
Philippians chapter 1, verse 11. That happens, and it can only happen if we are abiding in Jesus. Thanks for being a part of 21 days with Jesus. Jesus said, I am the bread of life. I am the light of the world. I am the gate. I am the good shepherd. I am the resurrection and the life. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. And today in John 15, Jesus says, I am the vine. Stay connected. Stay connected to the vine that you might have life. And he, he will remove some of the branches and he will prune the others. You be blessed today. God loves you and so do I.